Why, I drive? Really? Most of us agree. Whale lovers have been watching this lagoon near Vancouver Island as experts try to coax out the orca calf they call Quisaheus. That roughly translates to brave little hunter. The two-year-old was spotted March 23rd, stranded with its pregnant mother who later died. This one's just so sad because that uh, female, we think it's a, a female, um, saw uh, her mom die. And then knowing, of course, she would have known that her mom was pregnant because uh, essentially they're swimming sonograms themselves mm -hmm. uh, at the locating off of different objects. So she would have known her mom was pregnant. And uh, yeah, just a very tragic situation up there. They played calls for the calf and used tools to try to get it out of the small lagoon. They're now looking at other options, including a helicopter or vessel, to get it into wide ocean waters in a net pen that it can be released from when extended family members swim nearby. There have been successful reunion efforts before. Northern resident Orca Springer was stranded near Vashon Island in 2002. Noah says she was cared for in a net pen and transported on a vessel, ultimately reconnecting with her pod and having calves of her own. Experts believe the brave little hunter, too, can have a full and vibrant life once reunited with its relatives. These whales